Hey guys, how's it going? Are you excited for your upcoming racing season and in the process of installing your race pack data logger for the first race? Well, if you are and if you're looking for a couple extra tech tips along the way, today I wanted to talk to you about drive shaft RPM a little bit and actually the physical sensor itself. The physical sensor itself is basically looks like a piece of all thread with a wire coming out of it and a connector. This connector plugs into our drive shaft harness, but more importantly what I want to speak about is the part that looks very industrial or shall I say unbreakable. Well actually these are very easy to break because they're actually hollowed out inside because they're filled with porcelain, wires, and silicone. So if you go to tighten this extremely tight or get out a torque wrench or something like that it will snap instantly. So what I recommend doing is literally sticking it into the L bracket that we supply, spinning the nut up to it, and then giving it maybe a quarter turn with a wrench. And that way it doesn't necessarily need to, you know, like I said, be Hercules tight. It just needs to not move. So keep that in mind when, uh, when you're installing your drive shaft RPM sensor, because if not, it's going to look like this snapped in half and we don't want you to have to purchase a brand new sensor before you even got to test out your data logger. So like I said just a little extra tech tip to keep you guys happy and saving money and on the racetrack and putting race gas in your car instead of buying spare parts. So good luck in 2016 and we hope to see you out there.